does God care what I wear? If you would look at most Christians and most cultures, you would think, it doesn't really matter. God doesn't really care what I wear. Because by and large, most Christians reflect the culture around them. If it's a modest culture, they tend to be modest. If it's an immodest culture, they tend to be immodest. And furthermore, a lot of Christians say, hey, it's none of this external stuff really matters. It's about what is in my heart that God cares about. And it, it is absolutely true that God cares about what is in your heart. But today we want to look at the question, does God care what I wear? Does He also care about what I put on my body? To answer this question, I want to take you back to the beginning, back when man first sinned in the Garden of Eden, because before sin, man didn't use clothes. So let's look at the first instance of clothes and see if we can get a clue to this question, does God care what I wear? The Bible says that after Adam and Eve sinned, their eyes were open and they realized that they were naked. And so they, they went about to make themselves clothes. They made a uh, apron. The Bible says they made themselves an apron of fig leaves. Later, God comes along and makes them coats of skins, and the Lord clothed them. So it's obvious that their initial idea of what was acceptable clothing was not acceptable to God. They thought just simply an, an apron or a belt or a loincloth, God looked at that and saw that it was insufficient. And He Himself gave them coats of skins to clothe them. And that word it has the idea of something that does a lot more covering than just like a, a loincloth. And so yeah, we can see that clothing is important to God. There are, there are things that are acceptable to Him and there are things that are not acceptable to Him in the line of clothing. As you go on through the Old Testament, before the time of Christ, you see that uh, when, and when God told His people how to make their altars, He told them to be careful to, to not make steps that would, when the priests would go up these steps, that it would expose their nakedness. So you see that God is concerned that, uh, that people not expose their nakedness, and this, is, uh, this has a direct application in what we wear. Moving on into the New Testament, in the book of 1 Timothy chapter 2, verses 8-10, through 10, we find seven specific things that God talks to women about in relation to their appearance. Number one, he tells them to dress with modest apparel. In other words, not clothing that draws attention to one's body. He talks about shamefacedness, number two. Number three, sobriety. Number four, not with broided hair or fancy hairdos. So God cares about your hair, dude. Number five, not with gold. Number six, not with pearls. And number seven, not with expensive clothes. And that, 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 that's a lot of your brand name, high brand name stuff that people are pursuing after. The Word of God forbids you to wear those. So does God care what I wear? It looks like He does. In the book of 1 Peter, chapter 3, verses 3 through 4, the Word of God gives us five specific things that matter to God when it comes to clothing. And again, this verse is primarily addressing women. Number one, it says that women should not adorn themselves outwardly by plaiting their hair or by fancy hairdos. Number two, they should not adorn themselves by wearing gold. Number three, they should not adorn themselves by their clothing. In other words, they shouldn't wear fancy clothes or ornamental clothing. And number four, they are commanded to adorn their inner man, to make their inner self to be beautiful. That should be the focus. And number five, they are commanded to wear the ornament of a meek and quiet spirit. This is what God says about clothing. So does God care what I wear? Yes, He does. And He has these specific things for us to do. Lord willing, I want to make another video looking at some of the specifics of what it means to dress modestly. So. Stay tuned for that.